Hello watch fans, Berthier watches here and this time for you we have this Simia men's chronograph with reverse panda from circa 1970. Now this is what I would call an entry level chronograph. You've got those cool looks and the dial is very good on this, the condition is superb. But inside that's when things get, well, you're not going to impress anyone if you went to a uh, Hodinki party with what's inside this watch. It's quite a crude movement. Uh, and the case, although it looks really nice condition, it's chromed, it's not uh, steel. So the whole thing's quite light. The bracelet is stainless steel. And although it's not signed anywhere, it came on this watch. I would be tempted to put it on black leather myself, but I'm not sure if this was the original fitment, in which case, if someone's looking for this watch, they may want that bracelet. But if you want it on black leather, you can have it on black leather or rubber. It would work on either. So, it, as I say, it's, it's a fairly crude movement inside, and there's photos at berthierwatches.com. You start the chrono unusually at the bottom pusher, and you can just see it just jumps. If we stop it and then start again, it jumps. It, it is a cam push, and it's not the greatest. But we're not saying it is the greatest, and it's certainly not, you know, if this was the price of a much better watch, we would expect a better movement, but it's not. So start, stop, and reset. One of the unusual thing is the hour uh, sorry the minute counter goes to 80 not 60 which would make sense we see 45 and 30 quite commonly but 80 you know, great if you're timing rugby matches but otherwise pretty useless i'm not sure if that's the tail wagging the dog and they built the chronograph and it could count to 80 and well that will do then put 80 on the dial but good looking thing if lacking a little bit in the build quality and uh, there is also this very strange thing your crystal just flexes half a millimeter and clicks only when you're pressing on it it's secure it doesn't pop off but just pointing it out because we like complete or to be completely up front with everybody but if you don't care what the internals are and you're not going to use the stopwatch to time the Olympics and if you want a good looking reverse panda chrono this could be the watch for you without spending two grand not even a fraction of two grand which is what the price of a top time Breitling would be it's available now at berthierwatches.com and the link is in the comments below thanks for watching